Well, hello, Grime Stoppers. Every time I do my hair and all that kind of stuff, I never make a video. Uh, when I've got bedhead and, and it's all crazy, that's the best time to make a video. Anyway, this is for Mark Dice, and I'm going to try and keep this short uh, when the hourglass, <laughs> like sand through the hourglass, um, is empty. Uh, I quit the bed. We'll stop. Okay, so what am I doing? Mark Dice. Who knows Mark Dice? Somebody on YouTube knows Mark Dice. It's like, I mean, it's six degrees of separation on the planet. On YouTube, I'm sure it's like two or three uh, degrees of separation or one degree of separation. One of you guys knows Mark Dice. Somebody that's watching this. Get this video in front of him or just inform him that, look, um, here's the math. It's 7.6 billion people on the planet. Square root that, we have 87,178. Look at that number. Symmetry, backwards and forwards. All right, Mark Dice has more than 12 times uh, that many subscribers on YouTube. So uh, if we can just get a percentage of these prescribers, we get prescribers, subscribers, <laughs> hopefully they're not prescribers, uh, maybe some of them are pharmacists. But anyway, the idea is um, we get 1.2 million people informed, or at least get it in front of his subscribers, and maybe some of them will participate. In what? What are we talking about? Peace, love, and forgiveness. We're talking about having a day of prayer, having a day of uh, meditation, or just thinking thoughts that got you so messed up that even prayer and meditation, words like that are offensive to some of the normies. And we're not going to talk about Satanist pedophiles. We're not going to talk about Luciferian rituals. We're not going to talk about uh, Saturnists and all that. None of that, right? Pedivores, all this kind of stuff. Adrenochrome, ugh, all this stuff that... Okay. Uh, these are good people and they've been deceived to the point where they can't even wrap their minds around the fact that there are humans like this on the planet and to say that there are others uh, doing this they can't so fine we won't talk about that what we'll talk about is peace love and understanding peace love and forgiveness and that doesn't mean that we're letting them off the hook that doesn't mean that they get away scot-free because they're not um, the hammer of justice is gonna fall uh, but uh, for ourselves for ourselves, we need to make this shift, right? This is an ancient shirt. Like, it's got pukas and everything. This is from the 1990s. I managed to save this, and I just happened to come across. I'm like, oh, this would be perfect to wear for that, right? It's an old thing, but still, and it's beat up. It's the same thing. The shift still needs to happen, um, and it's, it's it's been a long time coming, but peace, love, and understanding. People are waking up, and uh, Americans are not going to be peaceful when they discover what's been going on. Um, so what we're going to do is counteract that and also counteract the crazy, insane rituals that go on on these two days. This is the equinox. This is the solstice. Uh, for 24 hours, uh, prayer for peace. See, and no one person has to do 24 hours. That's the beautiful thing about it. We just need 87,178 people uh, to have those thoughts of five minutes, an hour, 20 minutes, three minutes, whatever. Um, do meditations or prayers for peace for love and forgiveness. The Aloha Spirit. Uh, here's one that Americans know about and most Europeans, the Christmas Spirit. You know that feeling of the Christmas Spirit? Okay, that's the feeling you want to try to hold for just five minutes or 20 minutes or an hour uh, toward your fellow man, toward the whole planet. We're not going to be anti-war. We're going to be pro-peace. We're not going to be anti-Israel or anti-America or anti-Russia or anti-anything. We're going to be pro-peace. We're going to be pro-love. We're going to be pro-forgiveness. That's it. This isn't hard. Uh, and you will feel good after this. You'll feel great after this. And I'm not the only one. I know I'm not the only one trying to organize these kind of things. But what I'm trying to do is get uh, Americans to understand that we need, because uh, a day of reckoning is coming, make no mistake. But in the meantime, rather than fill ourselves with hate and, and strife and... I mean, I hate seeing Americans. Americans, you're all Americans. And because they put ideas in your head and put programming in your head, uh, you fight with each other. Oh, and they just laugh at us. Um, so peace, love, and understanding, peace, love, and forgiveness for just a few minutes, uh, everybody on these two days, uh, it's not asking too much and it, it doesn't matter. Non-denominational, non, I mean, secular or religious, it doesn't matter. These are universal human traits, peace, love, and understanding. All right. E pluribus unum crime stoppers. Look at that. I actually managed to keep it short under five minutes. Um, the sand in the hourglass is done. Uh, but the time uh, for this is now. Uh, we need to start organizing and getting it together. And see, this is the beautiful thing. You don't have to leave your house to do this. All right. E pluribus unum, crime stoppers, peace, love, forgiveness. And yes, I know I'm the worst one. Uh, but still, the message is peace, love, and forgiveness.